Hello friends, welcome. So in this video I'm going to show you what we have built with Laravel, the restaurant reservation website. So here is the front end. Uh, we have the section that we have the menu here, the section, and here we have a button to make the reservation. We have our story about us and here is the today's speciality. So all these menus are related to the special category also we have the testimonial here and the footer now uh, if i go to the categories right now we have a test category and also this specials category if i click here we get three menus for that for the specials category and also if i go to the or menu here we get all the menus okay next thing is to make a reservation so if i click here we go to the make reservation step one here and we have all the fields here all the fields are validated so if i click next yeah we have uh, the first name field is required and all the fields are required now here we have the date and time and we say please choose the time between 5 to 11 p.m. If I click here, also we allow only one week, so we cannot choose a different day, just one week, and also choose the 5 p.m. time. Let's add some uh, demi data. Okay. And the quest number now, I'm going to say 4, and the date is 30. So if I go next, here now we have two tables, and all the tables has four or more quests because we choose here four quests, okay? And also I have validated the table. So only the tables who are not reserved for this date can be shown here. Okay, because if I go, so let's me go inside the admin area. Uh, admin and reservations. And here we have a reservation for today with uh, table two and with table one. And what I said, so now if I see here, we have only the table four and table five because the table one and table two are reserved for these dates okay so if i delete this and go back and make a refresh now you see here now we have also the table two table four and table five let's say we choose the table 5 and say make a reservation and we redirect to the thank you page now this you can customize as you want and that's it for the front end let's go to the back end and let's start with categories we can create a category okay we can upload the image we can edit and delete categories also for the menus the same thing we can create a new menu with name file price description and we choose one or more categories for that menu and uh, the same thing we, we can edit and delete also the tables we can create new table we can add the status available pending or unavailable and if it isn't pending or unavailable we not showing when we make a reservation also here we have the front inside or outside let's go now to the reservation and here we have all the reservations we can create also in the back end reservation and we can edit the reservation and also we can delete the reservation okay friends well, that's it for what we have built if you like, like and subscribe my channel and see you in the next videos. All the best.